everyone, welcome to my channel, I'm Claudia, international makeup artist and today I decided to show you something a little bit more different but easy at the same time I would say, you just need a little bit of practice but if you practice enough you can definitely achieve this graphic liner look. For the ones that are watching my tutorials for a while now, you already know I love to start on a clean canvas and I love to prep the skin very well before applying any makeup because this is the most important thing. So I will start by using a toner so that I'm making sure the skin is well balanced and then I'm gonna use my priming technique. I will start by using this gel primer by Huda Beauty which is a very lightweight primer and it works perfectly on each skin type and then I will use a mattifying primer only on the center of the face so around the nose on the forehead and a bit of the chin and of course I will also apply a luminous primer this can be used not only as a luminous primer but it can also be used all over the face as a luminous foundation or you can mix it with your foundation it's a very multitasking product and I love the finish it just looks so beautiful Of course, make sure that those lips stay hydrated, so I'm applying my favorite lip mask right now, following up with the foundation. This is the Huda Beauty foundation, and it has a full coverage, so I'm making sure I'm blending it very well. And if you blend it well, it looks amazing and it stays put. Also going to apply the concealer in the key areas and I'm also going to apply the cream blush I'm gonna use the Glossier one today I love this formula it's literally a blush that anybody can use because it's so easy to apply and blend so if you are a beginner with cream products I definitely suggest you try the cream blush by Glossier As the graphic liner will be the star of the show for this look, I just want a very soft glow on the face, I don't want something very crazy, so this is why I'm mixing the exact same product that I used in the beginning to highlight the highest points of the face and I'm mixing it with uh, some Becca Dewy drops and I'm applying them on the highest points of the face and the bridge of the nose as well and then I'm gonna start setting the face lightly with some translucent powder, after that I'm setting the face with a setting spray by Benefit, this is the professional and I'm also going to to give that sun-kissed effect to the skin by using the Hula Bronzer.
so for the eyes this is 100% the most easy eye look I have ever done here on my channel everybody can do this you just have to set the eyelids by using a shade that matches your skin tone here I'm using base by Anastasia Beverly Hills you can find this shade in the Norvina and Anastasia palette and then I'm gonna go with the liner so when creating this graphic liner look you have to first of all imagine the shade that you want to create and then you have to look straight into the mirror so that you can actually create the shape first and as you can see right here I'm making a guideline first and then I'm starting to fill in everything and actually perfect it. And because I really want the eyes to pop for this look, I'm also going to apply the same gel liner on the waterline and I'm also creating a tiny little cat eye in the inner corners of the eye and then I'm applying the lashes off camera because I already have a tutorial where I show you what lashes I apply, how I apply them and how I apply mascara afterwards so you can watch that if you're interested in this specific technique and then of course I'm gonna add the brow freeze to make sure that the brows are staying in place and they look perfect so that they can frame the graphic eye And now onto the lips, I wanted to create something more 90s inspired, this is the vibe that I had, so this is why I started by using the Nude Number no. 2 by KKW Beauty on the edges and then I'm applying this nude lipstick by Anastasia to fill in the lip basically and then I'm also going to apply this gloss which looks amazing and is very lightweight as the texture is by Anastasia Beverly Hills as well. there you go this is the finished look i hope you enjoyed it and of course if you recreate it don't forget to tag me on your instagram stories and i want to actually see your creativity involved in this process so please if you recreate it you can also switch the color or switch the shape or anything that you feel like suits you best and of course have fun while doing it thank you so much for watching